All right, you know it's Jubilee Saturday. That means state gold up for grabs. Auburn's been the giant killers all season long. Same story another day at the office for the folks from Reiner Auburn versus Stonewall Jackson for the 1A baseball title. Let's get you to Radford. Eagles up early and add more. Adam Quisenberry sending that rocket over the second baseman. 3 nothing your score. Two runners aboard when Quisenberry is back again. That one going down the line. Scores two more runners. It's 5 nothing. Auburn defense sharp too. Ho! Oh, Dylan Akers right there allowed just two hits. Pitch to shut out the Eagles. Go out to a six nothing win. They get the well. I don't think it was Gatorade. It was a water bath, and they are the one A baseball champ. I went to school at Auburn. I was on the second second year we had a baseball team, and we went to regions a couple years, but obviously nothing like this. And to be coaching with my son on the team. It's just beyond words, but I'm so happy for these guys. It's incredible. I mean, especially for the community. We, want, we wanted to bring it home, and, you know, we just went out and played our game, and look what happened. We're here. Yes, they are 2A baseball finals. Dan River, John Battle for the title. Battle putting up a three-run third. That's Isaac Deal single to center. Trojans led three to one. Wildcats strike back two of their own. Josh Adkins picking up the RBI single. They would take the lead in the fourth with this RBI triple deep to center field off the bat of Bennett McCann. Look at that one. Yeah, it's out there at the 400 sign. But here's the tail of the tape. Tied at four. Bottom seven, two on Clark Sowers. Fair down the left field line, and Dan River wins the 2A championship in walk-off fashion. 5-4 your final. Let the celebration begin. I think our guys just gutted it out. We had several that were sick, hurt, and everything else, but it's, it's just the, the type of team we've had here lately. We've, we've preached all year about showing a lot of heart and coming in to, to never give up until the last out, and this, this ever since the playoffs, that's what they've been doing. All right, to the 4A ranks from Salem Stadium, LCA and Hanover. The Bulldogs of LCA out early, bottom of the first. Jacob Williams back through the box. Pierce Howard, Hunter Johnson come on down. 2 nothing. Liberty Christian Academy. Hanover would get one back, top of the second. Watch the dribbler right here. That's trouble. That would play to run. But this was all about LCA. Wesley Clark. Q shot, pass second, plating two more, and LCA takes home the 4A state baseball title. 8-5, your final. All right, a West Region Finals rematch in the state final. JF won one nothing the first time around in this girls soccer showdown. Today, Rono College in Salem, another thriller. Packed house at the home of the Maroons as Salem met JF for a title on the line. Down one second half, Cavaliers execute perfect play here. Olivia Magenbauer, the goal, and it's 1-1. After another JF goal, the Spartans respond with a goal. Kristen Honecker making it 2-2 in front. No goals in overtime. We go to PKs. Yes, the penalty kicks. And Olivia Magenbauer seals the deal for JF. They win 4-1 on PKs. Matt Newton and the Cavaliers are state champs. It's awesome. You know, they buy into just fighting hard, working hard. Uh, we look to get better every day in practice, and you see the result of that out here. You know, we just believe. You know, we know that we can come back from adversity. It's one of, uh, one of our core values is to be resilient. And, you know, they were resilient all day. They didn't give up, and, you, and we won. Meantime, the boys' soccer final once again populated by a perennial power. Blacksburg, 12-time Virginia State champs, wanting number 13 after three straight runner-up finishes, taking on Riverside this afternoon and getting fired up for that 3A final. The Rams' Sebastian Oliver looking to score early on the deep shot. Blacksburg's keeper Jordan Stevens comes up with it. Scoreless, four minutes left, second half. Blacksburg with the opportunity. Bailey Prosser, and that is... Just wide. And late in regulation, Michael Zang got the game winner. Riverside wins 1-0. They are the 3A state champs. Boys 2A final undefeated Giles and Maggie Walker tied at one at halftime. Ben Hazelton feeding it inside to Liam Gobble Garrett, who gets the net Trojans up 2-1. Giles comes back within minutes. It's Morgan Spiegel who fires, and we are knotted again. But Maggie Walker would have the final say as Alex Daglish got the game winner. Giles finishes runner-up 21-1. Your final was 3-2. 
Galax looking for their third state title in four years, taking on region rival Radford. Back and forth game. Galax senior Joshua Urbina racing a 1 0 Radford lead with this tough angle shot. Later, Galax would tie it again. Gabriel Ramos from distance. This one went PKs, and Galax gets the victory 5 3 in penalty kicks. We, did, we credit ourselves on hard work. And every time we get in a tough situation like that, I take them back to that and, this, and try to remind them that you've worked and you, you've worked for this and you've prepared yourself. And we start working, we work year round. So, I mean, there's no way somebody's going to outwork us for 20 minutes. So. All right, softball now. B's back in the state finals for their fourth straight year, looking for their third title in those four years against defending champ Warhill as it should be. This one a marathon battle will go to the bottom of the ninth scoreless. Heads up play by Jordan Vance behind second. Goose eggs on the board. This one would go all the way to the bottom of the 18th before Warhill got the victory. They got the run in the top half and closed it out in the bottom half. one nothing Warhill in 18. Patrick Henry in Northern Virginia today looking to win the program's first ever lacrosse title. They got it done against Atley 10-9 the final. Their first ever title that was from James Robinson High in Nova. Patrick Henry the 5A lacrosse champion tonight. 4A lacrosse title EC Glass and the Rams of Riverside. Undefeated Rams up 3-1 first quarter. Second quarter more of the same. Daniel Maltz on the fly in front. It was 4-1. We'll show you Glass responding, sack it Wood to the middle, and the score. This one was tight, but 8-6 your final goes to Riverside. They finish 20-0. On the way out, state team tennis. The Radford girls repeat as the 1A tennis champs. Cave Spring girls and Blacksburg boys take state silver. Brad Kozlowski wins at Pocono, and Tapright wins the Belmont, as seen right here on NBC. Sixth in the Derby, skip the Preakness for trainer Todd Pletcher.